We're not at any Christmas markets because none of them seem to open, so we're in Gino's. Thank you to everybody that sent us a Christmas card. And this is where the main lights are. Oh my god, it's usually better than watching yeah. it. Right, here we go. Blue and Joe's Burger Company. Of everyone each, are we sharing? Welcome to a new vlog, Vlogmas episode. Um, a bit random, we are in Leeds. We've been on the phone in the car, so we didn't have time to uh, start the vlog in the car. Still on the phone? Yeah, holding to Virgin. So we're just gonna go meet my family. We're supposed to go to the corn exchange for a Christmas market, but apparently it's not on. So we're just gonna go into Leeds and find something Christmassy to do. Google says it's on. Well, never trust Google. Here they are. They've already been in corn exchange and seen nothing. Was it very Christmassy? Christmas the Christmas yeah, market. The nice tree and trimmings, but yeah. it doesn't start well 12. It's 12. Like, oh, well, we'll oh, no, start. The food stalls and that, don't 12 or 17. 12, 12 o'clock. Right, we're in Trinity. So this is their Christmas trees. Got some um, people on ski lifts up there. And there's a uh, ski bar around there, which we might uh, have a look at. For some hot chocolate or something. I'm a bit hungry now. I want a still. Right, we've made it up to Millennium Square because this is where they usually have the German Christmas market but they're doing like a winter festival thing although we Nothing believe it's not open at this time. <laughs> so Nothing's open. We'll just go and have a quick look at the ice rink. So it looks like uh, ice skating is the only thing that's uh, open at the minute. Nice Grimbo tree here. So they don't open until 12 here either so we're, then we're going to head somewhere for a coffee. Right, we're finally in the Millennium Square one, so uh, that's a nice posh bar yeah, there. There's a lot of stuff still not open though. Uh, your Spudding Wrap, which is at every Christmas. Um, there's this like um, small kind of star flyer thing as well. The North Pole Star Flyer. Right, bit of a uh, change to plans. The we're not at any Christmas markets because none of them seem to open, so we're in Gino's. Uh, Leeds. In Leeds, we've been to the one in Hull. Nice Christmas tree. Got size of baubles on that Christmas tree, and uh, we're just going to have a nice Italian meal. Small garlic breads have arrived. Tomato and basil, we've both got. The food is literally flowing on the to the table. Well, he's got his tuna and bean salad. Very nice. That's half eaten already. I've got my meatballs. Lee's dad's got soup. And that looks like cow fat. What's Janine got? Oh, she's she's slimming. Risotto as well. Right, we've made it finally to the corn exchange. So don't want any food now. This way to street food, cocktails, craft beer, and Christmas shopping. Oh, I'm not hungry. It's white outside. a bit disappointed to be fair they had two stalls and nothing else the, the trimmings and decorations were nice as you saw have you lost your glasses no um but it will back this as a christmas market and um a little bit rubbish to be fair wasn't it rubbish it looked crass what was rubbish it was rubbish now rubbish. we're off to primark just so you can get some um, i'm not holding out much hope for this either some christmas pajamas for the apartment done got some christmas pajamas for the apartment the same ones. Only ones they had. Right, we're back at the apartment after a pretty disappointing lead out in actually that, wasn't it? Well, four minutes in the vlog and that's all. Yeah, I mean, you can tell by what I managed to get four minutes out of that day. Although it was a really nice meal with my parents and um, sister. I really enjoyed that tuna and bean salad I had was beautiful. Was your um, meatballs were amazing. Yeah. Was, was, it, wasn't, it wasn't chewy like chewy beans yeah. last time I went. This was like mushy but nice. Yeah, my mum and sister love Gino. I think they watch them on TV all the time so they've never been to Gino's before. So we were just walking past and they're like, oh Gino's there. I'm like, boy, let's just go in. And uh, I actually really enjoyed it. Yeah, um, the face lights on because he didn't want to eat there. I mean, Dad didn't want to eat there because he's, um, he's watching what he eats but he chose some soup and he absolutely loved it. So he was glad in the end. Right. 
We are back at the lodge. I'm just going to show you some of the... No, we're not. We're in the apartment. I'm just going to show you some of the Christmas cards that we put up here. Um, we didn't want you to sort of like read through all Christmas cards because there's quite a lot. But thank you to everybody that sent us a Christmas card. And you may see yours here. So thank you so much, guys. It's always appreciated. and I love putting them out. Um, like that Disney one. Mrs. Brown. We've never watched Mrs. Brown. Nick's mum absolutely loves it. I really like that one because it just reminds me of one of the uh, like EDB videos. videos? It, like the Christmas videos that you see on um, YouTube where they've got like um, hot chocolates and stuff. So, there you go, there you go, another Disney one. And then just a couple that I had to put down here because they didn't fit. That one. That's from Kylie and Jenny S. Yes, it is. Thanks, guys. And saving this one for uh, last. Last but not least, sending Christmas vibes with all these things. I don't know what these are. I'm, I'm too innocent to know what these are. But this says to Nick and Lee, happy 2022. Here's to another year of fun moments and friends. Can't wait to see what adventures we can plan from Sarah Waka Waka. Thank you, Sarah. So I'll put that there. Well, I'm whacking some chocolate in my mouth right now. Because if anybody remembers last Vlogmas, I also had a bit of a rude card there uh, mm. in that exact space. Mr. Mello. Uh, Mr. Mello sent a very um, tame, one. tame one this year. It's there. Merry Christmas tinsel tits. So thanks, Mr. Mello. Cabris. Where have you got Cabris from? Mm -hmm. No, I'm sorry. I'm on a diet. And we Just got like them. That. Yeah. Oh yeah, we have got um, a new Sex and the City and just like that to watch. We got these finally. Well, we actually wanted the blue Disney ones from Primark for here, but um, they didn't have one, so. So we bought the same again. So we bought the same again because obviously we have um, two homes at the moment. So I'm off to go and put them on. I want it to be Christmassy while we're here. I'm cold. I'm going to put mine on absolutely. You could put your dressing gown on with them as well. Eleven pound for the set from Primark. For the top and bottom, I'm gonna have to put them on, and then I might have a cup of tea. I think I don't want to warm up. It's freezing in here. It's not. It is. It's not. Very festive. Oh. I've just said, let's go and have a look at the Christmas lights in his pajamas. So I'm do something different. Guess what, Lee said? Oh, I'm not doing that. Not going out in my pajamas. No, pajamas are more cozy and snuggly. Well, it's frigging freezing in here. That's the downside of the apartment. It's always cold in winter. There you go. Stop Spent morning. six months last year of it being left this cold. Say something positive. Um, I'm hungry. There's your tea. Right, we got a bit bored, so we're going out in his PJs, his Christmas PJs. <laughs> To watch some, uh, look at some Christmas lights and maybe have some dirty fries. It's about a year ago since we went last, yep. isn't it? Into so. Home Firth. Right, here we are. First lights of um, Home Well, Firth. it's not the first. We've passed <laughs> loads and loads of villages. Yeah. At least we've got to film them. Oh, I forgot to film them. I was admiring them. You were chatting on WhatsApp to Chris. Well, whatever. Um, there we go. Lights of Home Firth. Some this is not there. the main light. No, this no, is like no. street leading up to it. So, we're going to go down to where you we went. Arrived. Oh, thank you, Google. Oh, sh have I missed it? Yep. No, I haven't. Uh, no, it's round here somewhere, isn't it? Is it this one? Uh, There's a nice ice cream pile on the right hand side, actually. A friend of ours knows somebody that owns it. Somewhere here. Yeah, yeah I think we've gone there. past it, actually. Oh, now the lights are nice here. I love um, white lights for Christmas. Warm white. So, it's been a long time since we've been to home for. The summer. Left here, left here. It's the summer since um, we came. When we went to that Italian, is it? Uh, no, we came afterwards with Mark and Hannah and we sat, we sat and had, uh, oh, yeah, I was yeah. going to say coconut fries at Joe's Burger Shack. What do we hope it's open? It looks to be open. It oh, be open. And this is where the main lights are. Oh my god, it's usually. much better than last yeah. year. We'll get, we'll pack up, we'll get out, we'll have a proper look. Oh my goodness mate, look at them trees. It's a lot more festive than last year. Right, we've had to park like a mile out of town. Literally a mile. I we come out in his hoodie. <laughs> I do have my pyjamas on though. We forgot that last year it was in lockdown that we will come here, so there was like nobody here. Yeah. So we parked up straight away, middle of town. But it looks like a really busy night in Home Firth. The streets were open, but you, yeah. the pubs weren't and restaurants weren't. But tonight everything's open. Everything's open and it looks quite a busy evening in Home Firth. But we'll go and show the other lights now and then get some uh, Vietnamese fries. I have some myself actually. There's a few lights on Nora Batty's Cafe. Wrinkled stocking. Just there, the wrinkled stocking. Uh, so this is the street where um, up there we had a drink in the summer. Was that this year? Um, I think 
think so, it yeah. Seems like it just ago. seemed like last year, but I can't remember what it was. And then we went across the road and had an Italian in Pica Boccolini's or something Pica like that. Pica yeah. And we sat on the river, didn't we? Yeah. In the, uh, and it was, I think it was just the start of the summer then. This is one of my favourite. nippy on a night. One of my favourite, is it a town or a village? Village. My favourite villages ever around here. It's only a town if it's got a town off. Right, here we are at the lights. There's, Seems so many more what's it called? Lou and Joe's. Is that what it was called last year? Yeah, Lou and Joe's. Joe's. That's where we get the Vietnamese fries from. Yeah. Um, they so, have the most amazing fries. Yeah. We tried to replicate it, didn't we, at the apartment last year? But I think so. You feel like you're falling into <laughs> yeah, it. I thought we were going to fall down there. I thought you were So, uh, there we go. Here is the main bits of the lights and home for... Why, the lights? Why do people just have lights up at Christmas when they're not really Christmas lights? They're just kind of fairy lights, aren't Nick's they? Nick's saying this because he has a plan to keep the Christmas tree up in the bedroom when it arrives. Why Ooh, not? Here's Abba there. Um, oh, let's go. All year round. Remember there's an Amber show down? <gasps> you know what? When I was looking at home first yesterday, I did see something about an Amber I show. Did an Amber Tribute now, yeah. Oh. Let's go then. <laughs> right, we're not really going to the Amber Tribute night, but I think it is um, over there somewhere. Just seeing people in Amber suits going over there. Would have been good, wouldn't it? Just to <laughs> uh, randomly end up in it. <laughs> no. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to have an Amber show dressed in the pissing pajamas. Right, here we go. Lou and Joe's Burger Company. Are we one each? Are we sharing? Uh, what do you think? It's Christmas, isn't it? Surprise me. One each then. Just waiting for his fries and I've just realised that this tree at the side of me is the same colour scheme as the lodge. As the apartment, should I say? Bronze, silvers, whites. My bar was not that big. Oh look, they've got a, uh, a tree topper. Two. No, no, no. Just, I'm sorry, what? It's, just, it's not wrong with a tree topper. Done. Two Vietnamese fries and Nick's got a can of their own lager. Lager, five percent, I know. Back to the car for a new tradition of eating Vietnamese fries in the car. Just walking past this um, little coffee shop, which is shut, which is shut. But look at it; it's so small. There's even seats to sit yeah. down. Look, yeah. Two seats, a little serving bar there, and then all the coffee stations and stuff. Here. Oh, an elf oh on the shelf. Look at that tiny sink. It's and like then a know, sink. little tiny sinks and stuff. Just makes me want to go in. I wish it were open. This is called Bear the Coffee Roasters. They've even got their own um, coffee inside as yeah. well. That's one. Oh yeah, we got two. Yeah, we way. got one each. Where's the, where's the fox? Yeah, here on my knee. On my knee. Oh, look at the coriander on there. You're going to enjoy yeah, that. Yeah, and the peanuts. Well, is that all coriander on top? Yeah. Oh, you can have that then. I don't want it, thanks. Let's, Let's have a look. look. Let's have a look. Let's so, open it. If you're new to our vlogs this year, in Vlogmas. There's a bit much for me, actually. We had these last year in Vlogmas. And May. In lockdown, I think it was. There we go. There's Vietnamese enough. fries. So the fries with like grated peanuts on, um, coriander. Hoisin sauce. Yeah. Um, jalapenos. Yeah. Chili, mayo, garlic. Just delicious, basically. Right, they were bloody gorgeous. That is one of my new, my favourite new traditions of Christmas, don't you think? It's only a tradition when you've done it about five times. Like Jackie says, putting their tree up the tradition, and we've only done it twice. <laughs> that was the second time we've done that. It doesn't make it a tradition until it's like at least five times or yeah, five years in a that's row. Two years in a row, gone to see the Christmas lights and had some Vietnamese fries. But it's not a tradition, it's just two years in a row. No, we'll do it again. What's a tradition, year. guys? Let us know in the comments below. How many years do you have to do it before it's a tradition? Five, I'd say. Then it's a tradition. Right, we're going to head back to, down towards the apartment now. Um, Watch Lee's going to go. Uh, Lee's going to go to um, a town with lights and casino as we're passing through. Never filmed it, and um, we'll be back in a minute. Right, we're just entering this little village. Oh, the Into camera needs a clean. Yards. At the roundabout, continue straight onto. Thank you, Google. The camera needs a clean. So we stopped. That was our first stop yeah. last year when we did uh, looking around the the villages, the, yeah. the church there, and. Um, that's all we saw really, wasn't it? I think we went down one of the back streets down here. We were just looking for Christmas lights somewhere. Yeah, we just came out and that's when we discovered the Vietnamese fries. Yeah, well yeah, it was that night, I think. It does bring back good memories, but it was not also It was also like not a nice memory, do you know what I mean? I Having have, lockdown in the I have, apartment. I have nice memories of lockdown because I did a lot of things, like I was doing that journaling. Yeah, um, and how long did that last? Playing, or a lockdown thing, and playing Warzone um, each week. I just thought it were nice. Obviously, it liked to be locked down. It, it's, but it, I've got mixed feelings about it. It was nice at first, but then soon as like January came and we went into like mega lockdown. The lighting must be fabulous on this lock. It went into mega lockdown and it just tainted it for me. But I liked I liked vlog Vlogmas last year when we went for the crepes and things like that. Hmm. The other thing that I miss as well. Um, that we've not been doing in Vlogmas is going on our winter walks with his boots on and going out there 
because the apartment is in an area where it's quite high up there's a lot of snow so it probably snows in here like 10 times more than it does normally at the lodge and the lodge is kind of near the sea so you don't really get as much snow but um, it must have snowed at the apartment last last year about six or seven times didn't it during lockdown well next vlog must we'll just spend it at the apartment then what we can have lots of nice memories of walking in snow oh no 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 we'll maybe come back for a couple of days when we know it's gonna snow get us boots on like when we went to that reservoir in January, do you remember? Yeah. And it was thick, thick with snow. And I loved that, because that didn't, even though Christmas was over, that still felt wintry and warm. The only downside about the apartment is it's cold. And in the summer, it's unbearably hot. Mm. Morning guys, welcome to the next day. Just making a coffee. Because the Nick's stomach is trying to uh, stick with decaf at the moment, so I'm going along with that because, you know, I don't mind the taste of decaf. Um, but it does mean at the moment I'm missing out on all this nice coffee. French roast coffee, uh, Joffrey's there. I've yet to open this uh, Apple Ever After Joffrey's. Um, and the, what was the other one? I'm be careful of that wine glass, which is for some reason being put there. Let me get this one. This one was have Happy Harvest Blend. I'm gonna have to start making some, uh, maybe even that on my own. So uh, here comes Nick, I can hear him. Watch him say it's cold in here because it is a little bit cold this morning. What's for breakfast? Just making some toast, sweet pea. Oh, I thought you got a block talking. <laughs> I want this pie. I was just saying because you're on decaf coffee, I'm missing out on all this lovely Disney Joffrey's coffee. Ha Happy Harvest Blend. And there's one that's got this one. This has got caramel apple and cinnamon in. Ooh. Should we try that later? Perhaps. Uh, later. It's too late now because I've already well, done one. Take it back at lunch because. Well, yeah, we've got Hannah coming we up. We can do nice coffee. We can do half one of them and half normal. Yeah. Well, I'll take that. Yeah, because Hannah loves coffee I as well. I can't believe how soft the pastry is. There's about seven or eight Right, we're out and about. We've just called at Lee's dad's for the Christmas tree, which is now there. So we're going to put that up tonight at the apartment. Um, Lee signed up for an O2 deal when we were at our Christmas party last week. Was it a week today, actually? Week uh, tomorrow? Sunday it was, yes. Week. Uh, yeah, Sunday, a week ago, whatever. Um, so, um, and the SIM card hasn't turned up. So, and they've already sent him an email saying that he's been charged for this month. So, we're going to an O2 store to get them to give him a new SIM card and reset the bill to start from today. So Hopefully. And then, we're going to go to an Asda. Ooh. Oh my God, an Asda, we're going to an Asda. Um, what do you want from Asda? Um, I just want to see if I can get some of these jeans that I got from Asda, which were really nice actually. Hello, I'm here. Um, and we need some of the tea. I want chicken and rice. I want like chicken wings with rice and I want some at festive for tea as well because we haven't done anything well, festive for the last few vlogs. Speaking of festive, um, tonight is our secret Santa. Oh, secret Santa Zoom, isn't it? With yeah. uh, our community. So, so we'll show uh, you what presents we got yeah. and um, what other people get. I want to see what um, the person that I got opened. I want to see him open it because he didn't answer any questions so uh, he's got something uh, that is funny and probably he'll not use and if he does then <laughs> his, then his, then his missus will uh, appreciate it let's put it that way right that was simple all done walked in he got a sim out scanned it in and put it in lee's phone and it activated straight away and um while he wasn't looking i got one of the uh, little coin things from his desk which were for kids but i'm a kid so there we go. You're thanks a big so, kid, aren't you? So thanks so too. I'm actually going to give it to our kids. So now a little trip to Asda. See if Something festive. <laughs> Bugger jeans. I want something festive. I'm hungry. Yeah, some socks. Right, we've got our stuff from Asda, and I'm just looking at the um, festive Starbucks menu because we went past Starbucks. We haven't just... done any this year, have we? No, not really. I was just looking in the um, tea selection, and there's one called Emperor's Clouds and Mist Tea. So You're I said, for any... You're I said, for anything. and Nick said, I said, what a crock of shit. <laughs> if it just said like. Like diamond encrusted tea bags, you'd be going, Ooh, you Sounds buy any nice. of them. You love it. You, Lee's one of these people that falls for all the marketing shite. It sounds nice. Emperor's it's a pissing tea bag. And mist tea. It's a tea bag. I wonder what it tastes like. No, there's no emperors. Like. There's it? no emperors in it. It's um, all clouds. Single origin pure green tea with light, toasty, sweet notes. I think I love that actually. Oh, God almighty. How much is that? Well, that's just a tea bag. You just so. fall for any old shit, don't you? Excuse me. It won't be any more expensive than what you're having. I'm having some that's a nice straightforward. I know what's in it and it ain't got a fancy name. Can you remember what you're having? Uh, <laughs> white chocolate mocha frappuccino. Skinny. Because I'm, I'm healthy. <laughs> yeah, right. It's just a regular thing now, and it at Starbucks. It's a piss take. That's <laughs> I what never it is. have what you want. So we wanted like a turkey sandwich called "Tis the Season." I'm sorry, we've got no turkey products <laughs> left. <laughs> never have it. Whenever we come to Starbucks, do I have that 
Uh, they never have all. We don't usually have that problem at Costa, do we? But always at Starbucks. No. They have my tea, Empress tea I've gone for. Uh, so we're getting... Something completely different. A toasty to be thankful for, it's called. With it's ham, hock, ham and turkey. hock, turkey and, and cranberry. cranberry sauce. So it's, 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 it is a, on the festive menu. Right, go on, get it out. Let's have a look what it looks like. Oh, so that's the white chocolate mocha. <coughs> <coughs> Choking yourself. Nice. Is it nice? It's very coffee. White chocolate and frappe and mocha, some other. Skinny. Mm, okay, I'm gonna have a skinny. I'm gonna have a try. Decaf, mocha, white chocolate frappuccino. Mmm. Oh, very sweet. Blimey, that's so sweet. You were gonna swear then, weren't you? Well, I'm actually. Yeah, you it's were. Very, very sweet. I know it's really sugary. Um. There we go. So I eat my half first. No. It's scalding. I can't tear it. Have we not got a knife? No. So Ooh. here is my festive cup. That is like scalding red hot. With the <laughs> Emperor's Cloud and Mist Tea. Very festive sounding, I think. Right, we managed to get it halved. So ham hock. What else is in it? Looks like a bit of cabbage or something in there. Cranberries on top. And it's got some turkey in it as well. It's got, I think it's cabbage or broccoli or something. Mm, nice. It's bloody hot. How's your pot of piss? Is it emperor class? What is it? I don't know. It's green tea, but there's nothing sweet about it. It's just green tea, I think. Well, there's no sweet in but green it... tea anyway. So you've just been another sucker for marketing names. Oh, it's not nice that at all. I mean, I will drink it. But... Point, but you bloody well will if I bleed bright and all. I don't, it doesn't tell what's in it, but... Mm, I can tell you what's in it. It doesn't taste of clouds and mist. You have a try. See what you think. Oh, wait, it's green. Mm. Looks, like a, looks like a turd floating in it. Just get it. Have a try. Ooh. Try it. It tastes like cabbage water. Well, it doesn't taste, it smells like vegetables have been boiling in it. I ain't got all day. Have that back. Right, we're back at the lodge. I don't know, why do I say that? You're an idiot, <laughs> you're an idiot, that's why. We're back at the apartment and the Christmas tree has arrived. So, we've always wanted, well, I've always wanted, have you always wanted as well? Not a Christmas until the tree. Day when I actually thought about it and then I did. I've always wanted a Christmas tree in the bedroom. I know a lot of people do have them these days. There's a lot of things I want in the bedroom, but I don't get it. And um, the Christmas tree that we got downstairs was on sale for $29.99. So we thought, bugger it. it. You only live once, every day's best. Let's have a Christmas tree in the bedroom. Even though it's very close to Christmas now, we won't be here we're much only, longer. We're only going to see this one night before yeah. Christmas. No, no, no. I think we'll leave it up after Christmas. Yeah, it's going to be cosy. We're only going to see it one night this Christmas. We'll yeah, this Christmas, yeah. Christmas. After Christmas, yeah. Right, get rid of that. Get rid of so, um, it's going to go here. And uh, we need to fluff it, put some lights on, and um, use the rest of the baubles that we have for downstairs. Does that mean we're going to have to have now a speed-up scene of us putting the tree up like we did at the lodge with a bit of Christmas music on to do it? Of course. A bit of Chris Rea? Uh, no, you can't have a Chris Rea. Why? So it's your favourite song? Well, we can have it in the background, yes, but... Yes, uh... I'm in. There we go. All done. The log fire on the TV. Always looks green, doesn't it? Whenever you look at a Christmas tree on a on a vlog, it always looks green. Well, they are green, that's why. No, it actually looks. The light looks green, and it's not. It's actually like a warm yellow colour. There we go with the lights. And ooh, ooh, I don't like those stars right next to each other and this. Then I'll let you titivate. Then, where do you want it? Uh, there we go. Got a star on top. Yeah. There we go. Merry Christmas. So it's time for tea now, and then we've got our secret Santa. We have. So, uh, right, I'm gonna let you cook tea tonight. Let's have a look what it'll look like from. Um, let me turn the light off. Go on then. From when I'm laid in bed. Move lights on and get me the spotlight from the landing. Man, there's something about it that's like. It's a bit thin here. Well, I did tell you when you were bushing it. It's a little bit thin. So, let me just take a picture while I'm. It needs a bauble. I'm afraid it needs a bauble or two there. Oh, well, you'll get but it. Yes, I'm, nah. I'm not picking it up now. A nice festive chicken drumstick rice and vegetables. Coconut rice, special <laughs> festive coconut exactly. rice. Exactly, exactly. In pajamas. Right, we're just um, starting our secret mm -hmm. Santa. So um, Nick's got his. I've got mine. I can tell mine's from MS. This is breakable content. That's well, we all I know about it. We have a suspicion that we know yours is from, yeah. don't we? Let Tracy in. You want to say hi, guys, to the uh, vlog, everyone? Hey. Hey. 
Alright. It's been such a while since we've done this, isn't it? Yeah, like, sat here doing this. It was almost last Vlogmas, wasn't it? So, uh, more and more people joining. And then we're gonna start opening our prezzies. Right, where's Tracy? She's there. Tracy. How do you get it full screen? Double click it, uh, baby? No, because that just makes it. They're pitching book pin. I don't, we don't what know you, how what, to, we don't know how to um, oh, work pin, some. There oh, there we go. I ended up with a, a crafty set of uh, like, um, like a little pin and it was peacock. Looks like a spider. No, it's a peacock. Any ideas who it might be from? No. Not at all. Well, with it being crafty, I'm, I reckon Zoe. Maybe. Right, oh. Hannah's going next. Indians here. <laughs> Jade's takeaways just Jade's come. Jade's takeaways <laughs> arrived. Oh. Oh, a diffuser. Oh, a diffuser. A diffuser. Thank you, never got that. I love them. Right, Nick's going first. Apologies about the lighting, um, it's not very good up here. Oh, it's in, a, it's in one of those flash gift bags. And it's got a gift note in, but I'm not going to read that. Not yet. Make sure you're showing it on camera. Well, actually, there's a, there is a gift note, and it just says, to make something to keep, your, keep you clean on your adventures with love from Secret Santa. Clean? Mm -hmm. Let's have a look. Put that on floor. It's, oh, it's a molten brown. What's that? That's the people that make the diffusers. They're really like, it's like the John Malone um, rival. What is it though? We saw it in Ashford when we went to the um, outlet there. A quick look. Mm. I think it's like smelly. Oh, it's a mini bag. travel bag. Hold on. Oh, I like that. It's like, it's like Ooh, sauces. What are they? I can't read it. Let me have a look. Bower, bath and shower? Yeah, like different things. Oh, that smells body lotion. Oh my god, that smells like that nom thing. Um, that is nice. In the bathroom today. I can't see what that says. Bath and shower gel. Oh, so Very thank nice. you for that. I haven't a clue who got that, although I will have to look at the label now and find out. Right, it's Lee's turn now. You know you opened this by mistake. It's a big box. What is it? I can't show this on camera. I think it might be for me. Right, Daniel's gonna go now. Go for it. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna have to take it out of the plastic. <laughs> what is it? Oh, it's a fish. <laughs> oh, yeah, Jacob, what's that? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what do you do with that? Oh, it's a fish. What do you do with it? It's a trophy. Right, Jade's having her go now. Somebody's uh, called it in for me, it's a fish. Oh, it's a fish. It's a fish. Oh, it's a fish. Oh, it's a fish. Oh, you've got some shoes. <laughs> Oh, there is something for you, pig. pig. Oh, for Barnes. <laughs> I can see him, so Barney. It's, um, get off. <laughs> oh, he sniffed it out already. <laughs> it's a, a little dog biscuit with his name on it. Um, and some festive dog treats. <laughs> and then there's um, a chocolate, a hot chocolate stirrer. And a little wax melt which I'm assuming is gingerbread. And then this was on my wish list, um, Princess Diana book. Oh. Very nice. Very nice hauler. From Marks and Sparks. Uh, Merry Christmas, Lee. Hope you enjoy them. And Nick, keep away from Lee's chocolates. Oh, from so it's chocolates. It says fragile on it. Ooh, well, oh my goodness me. That's why it said fragile. Right, hang on, let me just get it out of the box. Bloody hell. Oh, we might christen that tomorrow on a Christmas day, on a fake Christmas day. Prosecco and chocolates from Marks and Spencers. Do you want to have a guess who it was from? Well, 
Oh, I have no idea unless it was actually from Daniel Watson because he gave me it. From Rob, he told me to tell you. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, thanks, oh, Rob. Thanks, Rob. I'll, I'll thank him. That's well nice, that. What kind of chocolates are there? Doesn't matter because you're not having any. I bloody well am. Otherwise, you're not having any of the stuff that I've got. Very nice. You won't be washing your ass on molten and brown. Right, that's our secret Santa for this year. Well impressed with my uh, gift, and I must say I'm well impressed with yours. Me as well, actually. <laughs> Perfect really like for um, when you go away. Florida trips. Yeah. I've only sniffed one, but um, it was. It smelled like that um, diffuse, that gnomey diffuser yeah. that we put in the bathroom today. Yeah. So. We're going to finish the vlog because I'm going to edit because we are up early in the morning. Oh, this lighting, lighting is terrible. I'm just pointing the camera at the light. There we go, that's better. Um, we are up early to pick the girls up and go back to the lodge Picking where we are eight. having five days of festive fun with the girls. Hannah is coming up, our friend, with her kids' amazing camp. And we're just going to have um, like a fake Christmas Eve with them because obviously we, we can't be together for Christmas. <coughs> Excuse me. And, um, well, we could, but we chose to be at lunch. Well, no, well, we're not going to go down to East Bond for Christmas, are we? No, I meant the kids here. So, um, Our kids. um Christmas Day, fake Christmas Day, so we're going to open some presents, we're going to have a Christmas meal. We've brought the, the girls' main presents to the one yeah. so they're going to open them with us on Monday. fake Christmas, fake Christmas yeah, Day. Whatever that day is. So, thanks for watching today, guys. Hit the like button, click the notification bell, hit, hit the like button, drop us a comment below. And we'll see you on the next episode of Vlogum. It's getting very close to wine, aren't you? It's getting very close to Christmas now. And um, so we shall see you on the next episode of Vlogmas. Bye!